Bachelors, Hannah Ann Sluice has been making waves on TV as a contestant vying for Peter Weber's heart and grabbing viewers' attention after winning the first impression rose. But there's more to this Southern Belle than you've seen on TV. Here are some things you may not know about Hannah Ann. Like many of the contestants on The Bachelor before her, Hannah Ann had a successful modeling career before she became one of the show's stars. For one, she signed with the Miami-based modeling company Next in 2018, according to a post on her Instagram page. She wrote in the caption, So many years of hard work and perseverance has paid off. Thank you to every person that has helped me along the way. Before that, Hannah Ann was the face of an ad campaign for the fast food chain Sonic, which she shared in a post on Facebook. She's also done modeling for Closet Candy Boutique, repped the 2018 Spring Collection for Vanity Fair, and graced the bottle of Downy Fabric Softener, according to Cosmopolitan. And if you dig a little bit deeper, you'll find out that Hannah Ann has been a contestant in beauty pageants thanks to the Bachelor spoiler extraordinaire, Reality Steve. It became readily apparent that Hannah Ann was a contender for Peter's heart when he gave her the first impression rose, and followed that by locking lips for some serious smooching. And while some fans might think Hannah Ann was a bit much out of the gate, or that she simply came on too strong by repeatedly interrupting Peter's time with the other ladies, Peter clearly felt differently about her approach. In an interview with Cosmopolitan, he gushed, I'm really turned on by someone who is persistent and who shows me, especially in that kind of atmosphere, that they're there for me and how excited they are for me. Her intention just was so obvious from the very beginning and throughout the night. That girl knew exactly what she wanted coming into this and never... Um, let me question that. Peter wasn't just happy that someone was super into him, he genuinely liked Hannah Ann beyond her persistent courting. He added, Every time she came back, I got a smile on my face, got the butterflies. It was a pretty easy choice. On top of starring on The Bachelor and strutting her stuff as a model, Hannah Ann has also appeared in a country music video. You can find her playing the gorgeous girl at the bar in singer Chris Lane's video for I Don't Know About You. Lane and Hannah Ann's characters meet at a bar, compete at karaoke and pool, and eventually flee when pursued by a police officer. But in the end, just before they can share a kiss, the police officer returns, and it's revealed that it's actually her father. If you thought Lane looked familiar, that's because he's no stranger to the Bachelor family. According to an article in People magazine, Lane married Lauren Bushnell in 2019 after her engagement to Ben Higgins came to an end. Sometimes Bachelor Nation can be a seriously small world. You might not know it from seeing her on The Bachelor, but Hannah Ann has undergone plastic surgery in the past. She chose to have a breast augmentation done in order to make her form look more feminine. In a post on her doc's Instagram page in 2018, she admitted that when she got the procedure four years prior, she was very anxious about it. I had never had any work done before, and I was really nervous because you know, this is plastic surgery and I wanted it to look as natural as possible. While Hannah Ann may be an open book about why she chose to go under the knife, it's not something she wants to talk about with everyone she meets. In the video, she went on to admit that she didn't want her results to be too noticeable and hoped it would appear as if she was growing naturally with age. In the Meet the Contestants livestream broadcast on December 16th, 2019, eager fans of The Bachelor were introduced to Hannah Ann by host Chris Harrison. In the broadcast, he teased viewers about all of the drama Hannah Ann got herself tangled up in over the course of the season, and he said that she had quite a backbone. Harrison also revealed that Hannah Ann was introduced to Bachelor Nation by Bachelor in Paradise alum Hannah G. But what Harrison didn't share is that the pair are actually quite close and have been friends for quite some time. Hannah G turned up in one of Hannah Ann's Instagram posts in the summer of 2018, and the following year, she appeared in one of Hannah Ann's Facebook posts, both of them all smiles. Hannah Ann wrote in the caption, Life is better with true friends, especially a friend that you have dance parties with in your hotel room. Love you, Smurf. Some contestants on The Bachelor, like Colton Underwood, for example, have openly admitted to not having dated much when they appear on the show, even if they feel, in hindsight, like parts of their inexperience was a bit overplayed. But the vast majority of people who star on The Bachelor have been in long-term relationships before moving into the mansion. Hannah Ann had a serious significant other for a long time before she decided to make a play for Peter's heart. According to a post on her Facebook page, she had a relationship that lasted for at least four years with a fellow named Ben Taylor. And by the looks of it, Taylor was a perfect gentleman, someone Hannah Ann claimed has a heart of gold. 
Taylor last turned up in Hannah Ann's social media posts in February of 2018. One thing that Hannah Ann and Peter have in common is that even though they're both over the age of 18 and more than capable of living on their own, after all one of them is a model and one of them is a pilot, they both still live at home. They're both super close with their families and neither one was in a rush to move out of the house. Hannah Ann has documented the importance of her family on social media, sharing just how much the people in her life matter to her. In one post on her Instagram page, she wrote alongside a pic with her fam, Life is best when shared with the people that mean the most to you. In another post featuring a snap with her sister, she wrote, I won the sister lottery with this one. Hannah Ann has also taken to social media on multiple occasions to celebrate her friends, who she's clearly grateful for as well. Speaking of family, it turns out that Hannah Ann looks a lot like her grandmother on her mother's side. She made a note of this in a post on her Facebook page, in which she shared a picture of her grandmother as a young woman. Hannah Ann wrote in the caption, Didn't know my grandma was my twin until today. It's not hard to see the resemblance. They share a similar complexion, jawline, cheekbone structure, and nose shape. Several of Hannah Ann's friends and family members agreed, echoing their affirmation in the comments. One person wrote, You could be twins. Another commented, You're your grandma's mini-me. One admirer gushed, Wow, beauty runs in your family. Another Facebook user also pointed out Hannah Ann's resemblance to another one of her family members, writing, You are your mother's twin as well, not just your grandmother's. If you couldn't already tell by looking at her, staying healthy and toned is something that's very important to Hannah Ann. That's something she confirmed in a post on her Facebook page, in which she promoted a beverage with vitamins and collagen, writing in the caption, Create healthy habits, not restrictions. Eating clean and staying fit can be a long-term lifestyle change, not a short-term diet. That's not all Hannah Ann does to stay fit either, as she gave her Instagram followers a hint about what her exercise routine looks like. Alongside a pic of her jogging in Scottsdale, Arizona, she wrote, Morning run with a beautiful view of the mountains. As for what Hannah Ann likes to eat, judging by her social media posts, fruit is a favorite. In one Facebook post, she toasted a fellow diner with guava juice in front of a pineapple stuffed with fruit, writing, A cup of guava juice a day keeps the worries away. One of the first things that Peter shared with the public when he returned home for filming his season of The Bachelor was an Instagram snap of him and his dog. He wrote in the caption, Just got back from two months of the most insane journey ever. Told my boy everything and he can't believe it. As it turns out, Hannah Ann is quite the dog person too, and she's documented this multiple times over the years on her social media accounts. For one, she mourned the loss of her dog Bella on Facebook back in 2018, her faithful companion of 13 years. She wrote in the caption, Rest in peace, Bella. Thank you for the 13 years of amazing memories. I will miss you eating my strawberry plants and bringing you home leftover steak from Outback. Love and miss you forever, Big B. Earlier that year, she posted a picture of a super cute puppy who was trying to distract her from her schoolwork. Then, in May of 2019, she shared a selfie with a dog she sees when she's, in her words, home for the week. That's not even the full extent of it either, as somehow Hannah Ann always manages to find a dog to pet. She wrote in yet another social media post, All you need in life is love and a dog. Am I right or what? One thing that's abundantly clear when you look at the social media posts of Hannah Ann is that she travels a lot. That's not just because she was a contestant on The Bachelor either. Her modeling work has required her to fly to shoots in some seriously swanky looking locations. For example, in March of 2019, Hannah Ann got to spend time in Hawaii, according to a post on her Instagram page. She wrote in the caption, This week I got to pretend to be Moana in Maui and Kauai, wishing I could stay longer in beautiful Hawaii. I'm so grateful for the opportunity to travel and work with such genuinely kind people. Hannah Ann has also shared snaps from other sweet locales, such as Malibu, California, Miami Beach, Florida, Atlantis Paradise Island in the Bahamas, and Carmel by the Sea, California. So while she might be a Knoxville girl at heart, she's also quite a traveler. Reality Steve spilled the tea on who was salty backstage after the winner of one group date competition was announced. Referring to the fashion show challenge, he revealed in a tweet back in September 2019, when it was all over and Hannah had won, Kelsey was called over by production to the back. Thinking it may seem like since Kelsey was a former pageant winner, she has an issue with Hannah winning. Was told Kelsey was not a fan of Hannah. A lot of eye rolling. Sounds like a pretty tense scene. If that's really how things went down during taping, it wouldn't be too surprising. Hannah Ann and Kelsey certainly had their fair share of confrontation throughout the season, most notably in what's been deemed Champagne Gate. 
check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more list videos about your favorite stuff are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.